Good morning, everybody. And I say, you know, that would have been perfect timing, Nancy Noel, if I had said good morning and then the rooster crowed. Oh, I know, I know. It's, that I would know. have just been absolutely perfect. This I is Degas, by the way. If you just joined us, the great Nancy Noel, in the last segment we were in her barn, and you got to watch that segment. It was really cool. So here we are at your home. Right. And people will come here to look an original Nancy Noel, yes? Yes. So these are, are original? Well, this right. is my gallery that's yes. attached to my home. So right. the first thing that we did is we went down and looked at the paintings down there. Not all of them, but a few of the paintings there. Yeah. And then uh, when people come, then they do the whole animal experience outside of the disabilities program. These are people who come from out of town, out of mm -hmm. state, whatever, to buy an original. So then they come up here and they see this gallery. And then they eventually go into my studio and see what I'm working on there. These paintings in this room, mm -hmm. um, well, first of all, are, are the paintings in this room something that not requested? This just comes from you? Yes, yes. Is that correct? Yes. So someone has to come in here and be taken by it? Yes, exactly. And does that, when, when that happens, Nancy, does somebody look at it and go, that's it, or do they say, I need to think about this? What, what kind of reaction usually, do you get? Usually they love it, yeah. and, um, yeah. but sometimes the price uh, can be a little yeah. um, daunting. But yes, um, yes they, they usually fall in love with something, and then that's why they come here in the first place. And then a lot of times they'll come for one painting, and they end up buying another, or they buy, end up buying several. Let's go into here. Okay. And you said the price can be daunting, so can be I don't daunting. Get too personal. <laughs> but tell okay. me how daunting it can get. Well, yeah. you, can, you can buy a painting painting for under a thousand dollars, a small painting, right. sketches, whatever. Sometimes you can get one for three, four, or five thousand dollars, but then these go up to um, six you know, figures. Easily six figures, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna just pick one and you sit down, you're painting for yourself, obviously. Painting for myself. Mm -hmm. So give me pick one of the two and tell me about it. Okay. Uh, well this is probably the most interesting one. Yes. So when I paint, and I think I might have explained to you before, I, I have no idea why I'm painting what I'm painting. Uh -huh. I just am putting elements figures, whatever, together, mm -hmm. and, and, but it's going to, it's, at the end of the day, it's going to tell me a story. They, it kind of acts as my psychiatrist. Wow. So this is um, a crow, a fledgling crow, that um, is obviously going to be probably taken by the hawk. But when we think, okay, my God, this is terrible, this is, this is a horrible thing yes. that's happened to me, it's usually wisdom and vision that is, that is visiting us. So the hawk is a symbol of, of vision and wisdom. So a lot of times when people go through terrible things in their life, they think, oh my God, this is terrible, I'm gonna die, whatever. It, it's really not that at all. It's, That's great. It's just, I see it, I see um, it, and I can see where somebody else would. Hey, we gotta end this segment, but you're gonna take us right into your studio. I am. We're gonna see some more paintings, okay. and then we are actually gonna watch Nancy Noel paint. We don't think this has ever been done on TV before. No, That's in the final segment, so stay with us. Thank you. <laughs> you know that painting behind